the Bakırköy Women's Prison in Istanbul. Ali Risa Tolu comes here regularly to visit his daughter, Mashala. This time he plans to take his two-and-a-half-year-old grandson with him when he leaves. Serkan lives together with his mother in jail. After their half-hour visit, the boy is carried out by his aunt. Many other family members are waiting for them outside. They're looking forward to spending the weekend with Serkan. When I get to see my grandchild, I'm very happy. Then I'm so pleased. I feel like the luckiest man in the whole world. Mashallah Tolu was arrested on April 30th and has been in detention ever since. Turkey's public prosecutor accuses her of disseminating terrorist propaganda and being a member of a terrorist organization. Tolu, who only holds German citizenship, worked as a journalist and translator for a leftish Turkish news agency. Before spending the weekend with his grandparents, Serkan visits his father, who was active in a socialist party. He was arrested shortly before his wife was. Now in Silviri prison, he's also accused of belonging to a terrorist group. It's not much of a childhood for a two-year-old, living with his mother in one jail and visiting his father in another. After the visit, Ali Risa Tolu tells us that Serkan and his father were still separated by a pane of glass. This is the second time I brought him over here. Serkan sees him through the glass and talks to him over the phone. It's not nice, but at least he gets to see his father. He was happy and said, Daddy, when are you coming back? His dad said he's vacationing here for a while. Serkan's parents are trying to shield their son from the reality that they're both in prison. It was his mother's decision to have Serkan live in the jail cell with her. Ali Risa Tolu says that his granddaughter and grandson are being well treated. Still, spending the weekend outside prison walls is important for the child's development. Ali Risa Tolu regularly meets with his daughter's lawyer. Mashala Tolu's trial is set to begin on October 11th in Istanbul. Her lawyer is worried because she says that right now judges are ruling largely in favor of the policies of Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan. She can only shake her head at the charges against her client. In 2015, Mashala Tolu attended the funerals of two left-wing extremists belonging to the outlawed Marxist-Leninist Communist Party who were killed by police in Istanbul. The same year, she also attended a memorial service for a member of the Kurdish militia YPG who died in the fight against IS in Syria. The events were an expression of freedom of speech. They took place under the supervision of Turkish security authorities and ended peacefully. Now they're being denounced as terrorist propaganda, and attending them implies you belong to a terrorist organization. It's time for Serkan to go back to his mother. Ali Risa Tolu hopes his daughter will be released in October, after her trial. But he has his doubts about the justice system. They're always looking for evidence, but there is none. They only arrested her to get revenge on Germany or something. That's all. Turkey's government swears that the country's judiciary is independent. Mashallah Tolu's lawyer says that if the judge rules in accordance with the law, the journalist and her son should be out of jail in October. <laughs>